Shadow of the Clouds Rampage continues in his solo feature length debut. This is a fucking trip. Welcome to our horror review. Yes. Um, yes, I'm Randy. And I'm Steve. And this is Terrifier. Yes. Now, we're just doing all the Terrifier movies because we're going to see Terrifier 3 tonight. And what better way to then prepare ourselves for watching all the different Art the Clown misadventures and bloody... Exactly. And day 10 of my yes. horror was... Yeah. Uh, all Hallows Eve. Yeah. We just did a review on that. Yes. Um, so now we're doing Terrifier, and of course we had to watch Terrifier. Our, this Terrifier is like the love child of Damien and the Elm going, I recognize that Art Clown is super popular, and let's like let's, let's capitalize on that. Let's capitalize on that and just make it something that becomes its own entity altogether. Yeah. And he just delves into the sick and twistedness and why it's like if they made a human centipede four and human centipede five and a human centipede six oh like it, this is i never thought we'd see anything worse than the human centipede two well but, i don't know i don't know i think those are debatably worse in a way actually i don't know terrifier's got some fucked up shit nothing like seeing people connected from mouth to, to you know ass, what to butt or I don't even know if we're supposed to say butt you're not, I don't know if we're supposed to say anything like that I don't even want to just regardless of being demonetized let's just think about people's <laughs> mental sanity that don't want to be listening to this shit anyhow Anyways, if you're not mentally stable please do not watch our video for Terrifier because this movie is will not be and we are too we're also not mentally stable so it it you, you know, if you're in, mentally unstable, guess what? Join the club. Yeah, just join the club and watch Terrifier. You... Even before I watched Terrifier, I was not mentally stable. This is just... This just makes me question how sane I am for even being able to sit through a movie like this. So... Right? Let's go. Yeah, we spent this... two minutes talking about how much we grossed out as the movie is. Yeah. This movie <laughs> follows these two girls on Halloween night. They, One of them is drunk. And she, they are just dressed up in costumes. They go to this pizza parlor, and they meet this clown dude. Art sound familiar? And um, yeah, they run into their buddy Art. And um, after this, things go down sideways. You know, um, he goes on a killing spree after they kind of, after the one of the friends plays a trick on him, and then then slashes the tires. After this long thing happens, after this long segment, he goes out and goes after these two girls. And they in a end warehouse. up in a yeah, warehouse, this building, and uh, he kidnaps the one blonde friend. And, like, I, I don't even know how to describe this movie. I'm gonna actually let you which, attempt this. Which, number one, why the <laughs> fuck would you go into a abandoned well, warehouse. She does this to go to the bathroom. She goes to the bathroom. She's like, go this in the out. street. Well, a lot of they do it all to. the time in San Francisco. <laughs> well, this isn't the city. It's a private... Like, it's a private... Well, go find a tree. I don't know. Um. Well, in that situation, I would probably find a tree because the fuck going into a warehouse with Art the Clown. I never thought we'd be talking about this on a movie review anyhow <laughs> anyhow are you gonna try to attempt to tell the story of this movie yes because this i know um, I, i'm trying to think of a clear way to go from point to point point to point there's no clear way to go to point but it's just art. no there's it's not. art it's art this clown fucking just tearing he, up people he, in a warehouse he, he the, the, chases the, these this, two girls down and you think I first saw this movie and there's a scene where a woman gets cut from the they, she's like, hung upside down and it, she cu it cuts her in half from, from her, you know her upside down upside down, down privates just to the face well actually off the face because she cuts her in half um yeah but like sure know. yeah anyhow, anyhow um there's this. There's this. Also, this side plot from this, but, guy, this character who has to make a like a, a a scenario in her head for everything that's going on because she can't process. It's it's hard for her to process. Obviously, I don't know. I might end up becoming as schizophrenic as she is. Uh, 
I don't even know if to say that. After watching Terrible after Power 3. After, well, after everything that's went on with Art the Clown, I actually genuinely probably would be really, you know, it, it would mess me up. I think this poor woman in, is in the base, is in this basement of this warehouse, and she has this little doll who she pretends is her little child, her baby, and she has this whole setup this is like an apartment there's a landlord there's like a and and, there, and this girl that enters is the new roommate and she sees and then she calls art the man um and he is just going after i forget her name but the brunette and then Anyways. her sister comes to pick them up because they have no ride uh i forgot to mention earlier the blonde's friend's tires got slashed by art uh, he ca kills her, and then um, the, the sister of the brunette is coming to pick her up, and then the brunette gets killed, and then he goes after the sister, and she ends up becoming a... He, she, he basically Anyways. turns her into a deformed woman who is on a TV show episode interview. No. Anyways, no. These two know. girls go into a warehouse. This is a horrible. I'm gonna finish. So Art the Clown, yes, Art the Clown, real quick. Art the Clown is chasing them around. Yeah. Um, what? you think that these girls are the final girls, but they are not. Mm. Her sister shows up to pick her up. Yeah. And she is well. I shouldn't say the final girl because she kind of is and kind of isn't. isn't. She kind of isn't. Um, isn't isn't. So anyways, the whole rest of the movie is spent on Art the Clown chasing after her. Yeah. And she just comes into contact with random people in the building. Like this crazy woman in the basement, like he said. Yeah. Um, and then this cl cl custodian that's cleaning the, the upstairs floor. There's one of those guys. And then another yeah. kill from another custodian guy. Um, but yeah, it just ends with Art the Clown like fucking maiming her face. Like he just destroys just destroys her face, and then the cops show up. It. The cops show up, and Art shoots himself in the head, and is dead until he's rolled into the um, mortuary. Yeah. Um, in the hospital, and then the lights flicker. Something supernatural happens, and he like comes back alive and kills the mortician, and that's the end of the first movie. Um. This movie so is... So it makes him... This is the first movie that makes him a supernatural being. He kind of was in, uh, in All Hells Eve, but they kind of kind capitalized... Of, they kind they of describe it they more. They describe it. Yeah. They, they, they showed him being able, able to have these abilities. We just didn't really explore them, I think, is really what it was. So now they kind of give more... I don't know. They don't clarify them, but they give more... They give more... Um, uh, they give him... Uh, more abilities and kind of try to express it more so it's more obvious that he has them. Yes. Um, I think they try to explain a little bit more in the second one. Which and we'll real, get to. real quick, at the end of the movie, there's this TV broadcast with, with Katie McGuire from yes. All Hallows Eve. It's a, she's not playing the same character. She's not playing the same character. She's but, a news reporter. Yeah. And she's interviewing the victim, which is her sister. Yeah. Um, the one that survived with the face mutilation. Yes. And then she ends up, she ends up mutilizing. She ends up mutilating Katie and killing her. And killing her. And killing her. Well, I don't think she dies. Cause she's in the second one. Is she? She is. She's in the hospital. Oh, I don't know. Maybe. Well. So yeah, we'll we'll find out when we watch Terrifier Two. We'll we'll update you in the next review. This is a pretty crazy movie. Uh, go check it out if you have the 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 you, if you want to be messed up and if you yeah, like the Terrifier movies, continue to watch, like on um, comment and follow yeah. and watch for more. Hit that like and follow button for yes. more horror content. Continue to um, ensue the art clown madness with us. Yes, it's Terrifier weekend. Woohoo. Woohoo. <laughs> Celebrate art the clown. Let's yes. get the clowns together and roam the streets. Oh gosh. No, I'm kidding. That happened a few years ago and it was really creepy. That was more than a few years ago. That was almost 10 years ago. That was like ago. in 2020. 2016. Well, when It the Clown came out. Anyhow. Anyhow. We'll see you around. Yeah, we'll see you in the next review. Yes. Take care. Yes. Bye. Take care. Like and follow for more. Like and follow for more and take care. Bye. Bye. Bye.